oh, it's Boxing Day, woo, and you know, like, everyone went shopping today, and I was looking at my Snapchat, and I was like, I can go shopping too, why not? So, I went out to the mall, and I just got back, I spent like five hours there, surprisingly, I didn't see anybody from my high school, or like, you know, people you know, and then you kind of look at them like, then they look at you like, and you look at them like, and then you just feel mad uncomfortable but anyways went boxing day shopping and i'm gonna show you guys what i got let's start with this right here so this is one of those um it says a old loop chest expander but i don't think that's what it's called it's like the exercise band it's the elastic band that you can put around your like legs or you can use it on your arms like um i did a personal fitness class um, at my work, I was assisting a student um, at a college and they were in a personal fitness class and the instructor was like, if you're trying to get a booty and you're on a budget, you can't afford the gym membership. She's like, I live religiously like on this. She's like, get one of these. I'm pretty sure I only paid $5 from it. It was from one of those like cutesy little Asian shops. The next place that I went to in the mall was... Um, Lazenza because they were actually having a five for twenty dollar sale on all their panties. I don't know if I'm allowed to show these on YouTube, but I'll just show the colors, you know, to get the vibe, maybe the type of undie, but I don't have to show it all. Um they're also having their bras half off, fifty percent off. I didn't buy any because they didn't have my size for the ladies. Maybe next time, I guess I have the most like basic size in Toronto because they just were out of the 34C, by the way. Y'all need to stock up, Lazenzo. I also didn't ask for their cute little black bag with the cloth as the like straps just because I have so many of those at home and like she could have just wrapped it up like she did and I just stuffed it in my bag. Simple, less bags to carry. That's a pro tip. So, anyways, um, you know, I got some boy shorts. I mean, I mean, they're shorts, but, like, they're, like, booty shorts, but for underwear, which is really comfy. I like to sleep in these. It's just light pink. Um, I did get, like, three pairs of these. Um, I don't know what they're called. I think they have the tag on the front of them sometimes. But it's that really thin fabric that's stretchy, and there's no crease lines. So, like, when you're wearing leg rings, you can still wear, like, actual underwear and not like a g-string um it's called the brazilian it's a brazilian type uh i don't know if they're all called that actually no they aren't they aren't all called that it's just the fabric that's different it's very thin and i'm seeing these type of underwears everywhere where it feels like literally it's like see-through elastic but it's really thin and i think they're more durable so i got three of those i got a nude one a floral one and this burgundy one so I can wear leggings and actually be comfortable and not be forced to wear a thong or g-string or whatchamacallit. Um, mm. um, I also got a... I also got this g-string, but I'm not going to show it. It's white. See, it's white. Um, because this will be much needed for my birthday outfit, which I already bought even though my birthday is literally in five months. So this is more of a funny purchase. I actually went to Urban Planet after I went to Lazenza and I picked up two items. I don't know why they gave me such a big bag. For two items, such a big bag. Like, I don't know why. So anyways, I feel like I should actually just try on the outfit that I picked out just because it's going to be hard to show on camera. Yes! Okay, well, laugh at me all you want, but I do not own a onesie. It's a onesie with kitties and hot cocoa. I thought it was so cute. I got a size medium. It's a little baggy, but the baggier, the better. So I'm really happy with this purchase and I only paid $5, so I really won. I truly won with this purchase. I don't care how immature I look. 
I'm actually going to keep this on for the rest of the video. So, ha. Um, the only other thing I got from Urban Planet were their leggings, plain black leggings. Um, the hour that I went into the store, actually I went into the store for like 10 minutes, but within that hour, um, because it was Boxing Day, they said, for this hour only, leggings are $3. So I ran and picked one up and ran back in the line. Okay, so for the last and most favored purchase of the day, I went to Champs and I picked up my first pair of Jordans. Now, where I grew up, in the neighborhood I grew up, every girl, every guy had a pair of Jordans. I was one of those kids that just did not. I think I got a pair of LeBrons once, but I never even wore them out the house. It was like a hand-me-down, I think. Um, but yeah, every girl, every boy had a pair of Jordans. Um, and it just wasn't something that was worn at my school because I didn't go to the school in my neighborhood. I went to a school outside of my neighborhood. So at my school, kids weren't really wearing Jordans or like, yeah, like I never saw it, so I never got it. But I've kind of been wanting this shoe for a really long time, and I'm going to show you now. So this is the box. This is literally the box that, like, my brother would have in his room because my brother had, like, over 10 pairs of Jordans. And he'd have these boxes in his closet, and I was always like, whoa. And he'd be like, this shoe's, like, $400. This shoe's $300. I got my shoe for... $99 actually not even $100 $99 with tax so it was like $85 or $90 or something um but I got the Jordan 10s I think that's what the girl at the cash called them I don't even know what they're called but I got them they're white I was trying to get the Air Force ones but they sold out today they actually sold out how cheesed was I? I was pretty cheesed. Um, and I mean the low ones like this. Like the low ones like this. Because they had the Air Force Ones with the, the Velcro strap and it's higher. It's medium, I think they called it. I didn't like how that looked on my feet. So I ended up getting just these plain white um, Jordans. Really excited for spring to rock these fresh out the box fresh outfit first day you already know it's winter now so I definitely won't be wearing these but I'm really excited oh they're called the Air Jordan 1 low GS it says right there I don't even know the name <laughs> but I'm really excited because I've always wanted these shoes yo <laughs> hello <laughs> just kidding Anyways, so that's pretty much all I got on Boxing Day. Um, I spent like around $130. The shoes were most of it, like the shoes were 100 and the rest were just like $30 in total. So I'm really excited to make use of these things for the year. I tried not to go overboard because I know that they're just getting rid of the year's things that are in their store that's literally what boxing day is they're just getting rid of old stuff to make room for new stuff so i try not to go crazy unless it's for electronics but overall it's a pretty good year i got a onesie <laughs> i'm so happy onesie in my jordans oh! <laughs> onesie in my jordans that's gonna be like literally the like the name of the video <laughs> kidding kidding okay so that's all i have for today um, please subscribe, hello, if you want to see more videos, um, I don't know, comment down below what I should record next, like, I could give stories, I could give advice, um, you know, advice, um, with starting the new year, being a university student, keeping good grades, having good energy, like, let me know what you want to know, do you want to know some tea, like, kidding. We're not like that yet. We'll get there. 
But anyways, I'm exhausted. I've been at the mall for like five hours. I have to take my makeup off. Like, I'm gonna go now. <laughs> so, yeah, Sinitra is gone. Sinitra has to go, so he has to catch some Z's. Like, um, we'll see each other soon. <laughs>